crime rate is down, uh, almost 4%. And uh, serious crime, which we characterize as it's called part one crime, which are seven offenses of our most serious offenses, are basically steady. It's up 0.3%. So uh, pretty much consistent with where we were last year. Robberies are up dramatically. Well, those are up uh, uh, about 40%, 40 to 50%. And uh, this is going through October. When you look at trends across the nation, a lot of it, um, when people are talking about crime stats related to the economy. The one thing that uh, we're going to work on going forward, though, is really differentiating between the, uh, the robbery where somebody goes into a jewelry store, goes into a liquor store, versus something that happens on the street, which many times isn't exactly what it appears. Uh, there are other things going on in the neighborhoods where uh, some people are involved in uh, narcotics and uh, they'll, they'll characterize it as a robbery when really it was more to it. So we've had a few of those recently, and uh, so the true number is, is difficult to get to, but uh, uh, that's one of our goals going forward. Our motor vehicle thefts are uh, down 15%, uh, which is um, something that we've really been working on, making sure uh, people understand about uh, starting the car and leaving it running and going back inside, especially in these, during these cold snaps. And so that's something we're really um, pushing towards. So the motor vehicle thefts are one that is down. Uh, we've had some decreases in batteries and assaults. So uh, it's, it's pretty much consistent with last year. Uh, unfortunately, our, um, our homicide rate has uh, gone up by two from last year. So that's troubling as well. We've had four year to date, and uh, last year we had two. There are two that are gang related, and our gang unit is uh, our, the ones investigating our gang unit. And uh, one was, uh, we have a warrant for the arrest. Of, of the person we believe fled the area, and that was more of a uh, domestic type uh, uh, struggle between uh, husband, wife, boyfriend type of situation. And uh, our last one was a robbery, uh, the, uh, the, the youngster leaving the skate park um, right. earlier this year. I try to be very active with, um, with the, the patrol officers, and we've created uh, a couple new units within the police department and some, uh, some meetings within the police department as well to make sure communication comes straight from the officers through all levels of the police department. Uh, the, from all levels, from sergeants, lieutenants, deputy chiefs, and myself, are all expected to be at neighborhood meetings, are all expected to be um, engaging in um, our efforts, the entire police department's efforts out in the community. Uh, if we can identify trends or issues early, by just that casual conversations you have with residents at neighborhood meetings, it's important that we work with them to solve those problems.